Hey everyone, Enforcer here with another Minecraft tutorial on how to install the Minecraft Snapshot. Now another one came out today on October 17th, so if you're watching this today, then here's the latest update. I'll put the link in the description where to get it. It's pretty much www.mojane.com. You want to download the client. I'll show in a later video how to install the server and run it and stuff like that. It's pretty simple. But in other words, we just want to download the Minecraft.jar, hit keep, and we're just going to move it to just desktop. Now we're going to hit start, and we're going to type in app data, which is a quick way to get to your roaming folder, and then click .minecraft, and then go to your bin folder. Now I'm going to show you guys two ways to install it. One with Magic Launcher, and one with regular Minecraft. I don't know if most of you have heard of Magic Launcher, but we'll show you guys that too. But pretty much what we're going to do is we're going to take this Minecraft.jar and we're going to just drag it right over and it's going to ask us to replace the current one that's there because that's the regular 1.3.2 Minecraft. And we're just going to move and replace. Now when we launch Minecraft, it should say we have 12 week 12, 42. And it does. 12 week 42A. Which is great. So that means it worked. So now we're going to relaunch this, hit run options force update all right so now we don't have the snapshot again now i'm going to show you guys how to install it with the magic launcher now the magic launcher is pretty cool it helps it helps like if you like run a bunch of mods and stuff like that and you want to join like a server that's running just straight out regular minecraft this program is great because it allows you to do that type of stuff and this is pretty much the layout of it. And all you really do is, all right, we're gonna redownload the snapshot because I need it again. Actually, no, I don't. Just drag this stuff. All right, so now I'll put the link where you get it to. It's pretty much on MinecraftForms.net. You just hit um, for Windows or Mac. But I'll put the link in the description as well. But pretty much all you do is. So say we have the Minecraft.jar. I'm going to rename this one to Minecraft Snapshot. I'm just going to drag this over to the bin folder. And then I'm going to hit Setup. Now, you'd want to make a new one. So I'll delete this one. Yes. Now you just want to hit New. And then hit, just type in anything you want. You can type whatever you really want here. Just, but I'm going to put a Snapshot. And then we're going to select the Minecraft jar folder, which is in C, Users, Enforcer, App Data, Roaming, Minecraft, and in the bin folder. And then we're going to select Minecraft underscore snapshot and then hit open. And I'm going to disable this because that's not really needed. And that's pretty much all you got to do. Hit OK. And then now you can select between the two. Default, which if you run that, should run the regular Minecraft 1.3.2, which it does. And if we reopen it again with um, snapshot and login, you'll see that we're running the 12 week 42A. So there you have it. That's how you install the Minecraft snapshot with two different ways. If you guys have any questions or um, have problems, um, leave it in the comments below. Remember to like the video if you like it and it helped you. And um, Next couple of weeks, I'm going to be pushing out some videos on how to do redstone, you know, redstone tutorial videos. So if you guys have any suggestions or have any questions on how you do something, send me a PM or put in the comments below, and I will show you guys how to make that stuff. And um, that's all I got. Hope this video helps you out, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.